Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing perfect guys. Today I want to show you something. I don't know if you really have this in your area, but this is some technology that's it's kind of unique, I'm pretty pretty sure. You know, Ginat is one of the foods that we eat a lot in my culture in particular. So we found a way of unshelling the ginats because somebody could be having like let's say like 15 bags of ginats and definitely you cannot be shelling with hands like this manually like this that would take i don't know maybe the whole year or something i don't know so there's a simple machine here guys which can shell the dinner and very very fast very efficient i can assure you right guys so today i'm here to show you how we do it in my village especially for people who, for people who do commercial commercial best kind of uh um, work with genus like people who sell buy genus like that so they buy maybe when it has the shells then they come and remove the shells using this machine there yeah? then they go and sell when it's like grain totally like this like this yeah so guys if you're first time here make it a point to subscribe already i am here to show you meanwhile i'm also eating some maize here yeah? <laughs> roasted maize so what happens is you just pour it here like this So you just hold it like this at the side. Yeah, okay. You need some kind of energy. <laughs> I'm telling you guys, this thing needs a lot of energy, and that's the reason I started with eating before even doing the work. But, woo! <laughs> these dinners in just i don't know like five minutes or something i can tell you that guys if i was using my hands i'd probably take two hours or even three doing this and just like what i'm done removing the shelves so I think you can see how efficient it is. It does not even break the, the nuts, like the seedlings come out really clean, not broken. I think you notice these ones are really small. There are some seedlings that come out small with the shells like this. And I can tell you this one, if you were to use this machine, this will just be sliding on top of it so it won't grind it well and the best way to do it is using this you just kind of do it manually to avoid wasting so this is still better than 
bending, use removing the shells using the hand. Because it's still faster than the other way. So guys, what happens? This ladies here are just here to work. They get ready for people to bring that dinner. So I brought mine here, and they just bring and clean it for you. And the dinner will just come and move like that. So the, that is just their work. They wake up in the morning, straight here until evening. Then they go back home. So people earn in different ways. I can tell you that. So guys, my dinner is here, ready. You can imagine all that. I came with a full sack like this. Remember when I was poor and eating through the machine, it was full up to here. So it means all this was just rubbish. The only genuine thing is just this only. So for this quantity that I just uh, removed the shelves, I'm going to pay 2,000 and then I should be less than one dollar. <laughs> So there are these ones that remain and I'm, I'm going to just sort this from home. So I'm going to pour it on top here. Because I don't want it to mix the other one. Mommy, bye. Guys, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, in case it's your first time, make it a point to subscribe. As for me, I'm going home. I want to make some paste. You know, uh, or the first call it Jeanette's paste is like uh, I don't know, like our master spread in the kitchen. I once told you that. So guys, I'm off to make my master spread for my kitchen. I'm out.